Okay. Each calculation was done by these two tubes and half of this tube. These two tubes and half of this tube did the plus HM calculation. This is the minus DM calculation. This is the minimum burst altitude calculation. The estimated burst order calculation. What The way it worked is it has a set of resistors in here that was set up a resistor network. So this would actually do the calculations just based on this resistor network. And this is simply the amplifier that sent the information back. What was really funny about this is it only took this about half a second to saturate. And once it saturated, it wouldn't calculate anymore. So they developed these zero set switches. And what they would do is, is every second, it would short the output of this to ground. Jeez. And then it would start calculating again. So they'd short it, it would calculate, they'd grab that calculation, send it on, it would saturate, they'd ground it, and they'd just do that over and over again. So what happens if like one of these parts actually break? You right now have to replace it. Where, where do you go for something like oh, that? Oh, th these have not worked in a long time. Oh, okay. These, these electrolytic capacitors, have been have broken down a long time so, ago. Yeah, we we can't down. turn we cannot turn on pipe bolts at all. Okay. We can turn on the AC power just to get filament voltage, um, but we cannot turn on pipe bolts. Yeah. You have to go to just like yeah. antique restoration shop. Yeah, yeah. and then uh, it'd be kind of fun if you, then when we um, I mentioned this thing does trigonometry, how it does that. Is these potentiometers are all manufactured to do trigonometric functions. I mean, these are like cosine pods, sine pods, you know, uh, angular mills. Well, we didn't know that this was ever open. So that's that's how it that's how it operates. Very cool. Yep. This is the time to intercept computer. What it does is. It's sitting right now at a half second. It's very limited. At a half second before intercept, it pushes this button, and that's how the missiles burst. That's what sends the burst command. It's this itty bitty little switch here on a cam. Jeez. Yeah, look at all that. It's just pure. It's just. It's all. It's all mechanical. It's an analog computer. Wow. What's this? That's amazing. Engineering that has to go into this. Oh my Standard. gosh, yes. Just figuring all this out. Yeah, figure out how to how to actually groom a potentiometer so it comes up with the exact sign of the input. Yeah. How do you do this? Oh, the, you know, that's okay. And you uh, three phase uh, synchronous. Okay. Transmitter. They tell you where it is exactly. Yeah, those are servo motors. Yes. Awesome. All right. Well, thank you very much. You're Appreciate welcome. It. No problem. Hope you enjoy your tour.